Hello students, welcome to your biology class. Today I am going to show you something. See, I have kept what is this? A piece of bread. But this piece of bread has become unfit for consumption because it is spoiled. Spoiled why? Can you see this white grayish patches here, over here? These are actually group of organism called fungi. We say fungus has grown so it has become unfit for consumption. We cannot take this as our food. Right? So what are fungi? Fungi actually a group of organism which are growing on dead and decaying substances. Now this fungi which is growing on bread, these are called bread mold. The fungal spores are generally present in the air. When they land on wet and warm things, they germinate and grow. What did I do? You can also do this activity. I moistened the bread and kept it covered in some warm place. And after 2-3 to three days, I saw these patches which has appeared. Now if I put this under microscope, what I am going to see? This type of round structures which has on a stalk as if some round structures which are there. These round structures actually they are spore sacs. Spores which are very small microscopic structures which cannot be seen and very light. So it is carried by the air. When these spore sacs which become mature, it ruptures. And the spores come out and when they fall on some wet surface they grow so this also happened in this bread uh, on this bread actually this group of organism this is one example of fungi which has uh, I have told other like mushrooms mushrooms you have seen this uh, umbrella like flappy structures which are appearing uh, on the trees uh, bark of the trees or maybe uh, on the ground and some of these which are edible, that is we can take this as food, not all, some of this are very poisonous also. So these are called mushrooms. So mushrooms, bread mold, these are the examples of fungi. And they show a type of nutrition that is called saprotopic nutrition. So here you see mode of nutrition in fungi. The secret, so how do they take the food? The secret digestive juices on the dead and decaying matter. So as they are growing on some dead and decaying matter, they secret digestive juices on that matter and convert it into a solution. They convert it into a solution. Then they absorb the nutrients from it. So this mode of nutrition in which organisms take in nutrients in solution form from dead and decaying matter is called saprotropic nutrition. So at time you get saprotropic nutrition. Plants which use saprotropic mode of nutrition are called saprotrophs. Plants which use saprotropic mode of nutrition are called saprotrophs. So today what we have learned, learn saprotropic mode of nutrition and saprotrophs. I request you to see the description box and uh, where I have given the worksheet. Thank you children.